What's up everybody, it's DJ Nolan. Welcome to a gaming video. Um, it's a gaming video. It, there's nothing really to say about it. Today I'm playing Firewatch. Uh, it's a story game. There is cussing in it. So I'm just going to warn you there's cussing in this, but it will be censored. Uh, but yeah, uh, I'm not even going to blabber my mouth and be like, bleh, 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 and I'm just going to go into the game. I'm playing it on my Xbox, so sorry if I look up here because my TV's up here, but the camera's down here. Sorry that my webcam quality is a little lower because I am playing, or I am recording on my computer's webcam. So it is a little lower quality because my actual camera, which is right here, is dead. And I just, and I only have enough time to record a video tonight before I have to record another video tomorrow. New game. This game is probably really cool. Campo Santo presents Incorporation with Panic Inc. Team Boulder, Colorado, 1975. You see a Julia. Oh, she's about your age, late 20s, laughing with well-dressed professors and grad students from nearby CU Boulder. You're Henry. You, Henry, are out drinking with your pals, Brocher. Drunk. Of course I am. Of course. Oh, that's how. Okay. So what? So, oh, this is what I say. Uh, so what's, so what's your, you know, major or you? Ooh, you're pretty. You're pretty. Let's go. So what's your major? You slur the word major and it smells like cool. You give an awkward smile. Event, uh, evolutionary biology, she says. And I'm a professor. Cool, you reply. What's yours, she asks. She sniffs the air. Uh, toxicology? Wow. Was that a burn, you ask? She says, definitely. Worried to hurt your feelings, she asks if you want to split a cheeseburger. I can't eat cheeseburgers. I'm on a diet. Oh, whoa. This can't, whoa. Well, I better turn up the sensitivity. This is, uh, but now there's subtitles for you guys. Uh, oh, got the backpack. I press. Okay. That is. Okay. Oh, load the gear, load the gear. Load that gear. Boom! We've got the gear loaded. Oh, crap. You date for years. She drives you absolutely nuts. It's great. Okay. You move in. You share an apartment near the school with a view of the mountains. You two drink beers out on the deck. You drink beer just about anywhere. Oh, Julia wants to get a dog. Doesn't everybody? I love dogs. There's a scruffy, undersized beagle. Julia, la Julie, Julie, Lila. Julia is in love. She wants to bring it with her to class. There's also an intimidating but gentle-eyed German Shepherd. Nothing bad could happen to Julia while walking this dog. It's a bad Okay. Well, uh, so you pick up the beagle and she names him Bucket. Or you adopt a shepherd and name him Mayhem. I love German Shepherds, so I'm gonna go with that. Mayhem is an excellent dog. He loves wrestling with you in the park and he goes with Jul and he goes with Julia on her runs. Even though he's too big to bring to school, Julia loves him all the same. Mayhem is a friend, child, and pet all rolled into the one. I think most of our pets are. 1979. You talk out on the deck. It's summer, 9.30 p.m. And the heat still radiates off the high desert. What do you think about kids, she asks. 
kids, they're not very smart or good in much. I'm saying if we have some, a couple of idiots. Should I say that would be pretty good or one day? Why rush? Well, we're like 32 by now, right? Or late 20s? So do this one. Yeah, that'd be pretty good. In that case, we should probably get married. Yeah, I would like that, you say. These kids are going to be sc screwed up enough. It's probably for the best of their parents. <laughs> you say she's absolutely right. That's funny. That's comedy. I like that. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. This looks good. The uh, like graphics. Wow. Thorofail. Therofail, Thorofail. I'm just gonna say Thorofail. Trailhead. Um, map. Do not forget to check in. You're in their country. Learn to live with birds. Wait, did I get my bag? Oh, oh yeah, I probably. Okay, no, I didn't get. I did get my bag. Well, let's walk down this beautiful path. This game is amazing looking. Like, my gosh. Holy crap. Oh. It's a Thursday night and Julia is four hours late. She doesn't call. You're worried and getting angrier by the minute. She walks in after you've gone to bed. Uh, she's not quite drunk, but you can clearly see she's been having a fun time. You fight when she gets between the sheets. You get mad or you ignore her. Well, neither of these are the right answer. You don't do either of these. But I mean, instead of getting mad and like starting an argument, it's probably best to ignore if that's my only two choices. You don't touch each other all night. The next day you feel guilty for being so angry and ask her about her evening. She says it was great. You hold into you hold in onto a tiny pillow of resentment. Make some coffee and go to work. 1981. Jul Julia still likes to draw. She draws plants from her research. She draws all the places you go. She draws you. Uh, oh, she draws me. Uh, you pose and flex like a He-Man, or you frolic like a Victoria's Secret model. That, the game, you're fun. Do this one. Why not? Very nice. Very nice. Whoa. Whoa. This looks amazing. Wow, I'm sorry I'm not looking at you guys. I'm looking up at my other, looking up at my TV up here. Oh, wow, guys. Oh, I can run. Yeah, I forgot. Oh, what's this? Two Forks Lookout Tower. Eight mo more miles still. Whew. Ooh, pop. Ooh. Yoinker. Wow. It just looks amazing. 1982, during the summers, you and Julia enjoy walking mayhem at night. There's a festival in town. It brings folks from faraway places. One of them tries to mug you with a knife. Took a dark turn, okay. Oh, mayhem runs away. May, me, move. D -d -d Dog, Julia yells. She gets flustered and has trouble speaking when she is stressed. You confront the attacker. You scare him away or you beat his face in. I mean, that could get me in jail or prison and I don't want that, so scare him away. I don't know how it would be like, oogly boogly and scare him away, but whatever. You reach in your pocket like you've got a gun and threaten to kill him. You manage to scare away all three of, wait, you manage to scare all three of you. You manage to scare all three of you. Whoa, so I scared myself, Julia, and the guy. Okay, Julia asks to take a different path from that day forward. You say, okay, you don't want to go that way either. From then on, you walk by the river. I like rivers. 1984, plans to have kids get waylaid by work. Julia gets offered a job at Yale. Yale is in Connecticut, 2,000 miles away. It's it's a great job associate department. She wants to move. Oh, okay. You absolutely do not. 
uh, convince her not to take the job or agree if she commutes back and forth. What are these? A this guy is not very good. He's kind of stubborn. Um, I guess I wouldn't want to like ruin dreams, so agree to commute. You ask her if she'll commute back and forth. You don't want to move to Connecticut. She says that'll be hard, but she'll do it if you won't move. You tell her not to pass it up if it's what she wants. She agrees, then she flies back to Boulder three times each semester. I don't want to know how much money that is, even paying for college and flying. It's much. 1985, Julia is sent home from Yale on paid leave after having an episode. She lost it on a colleague for borrowing books that were important for her research. She didn't remember she had happily loaned them to him just two days prior. She was found crying in the stairwell. You say that maybe you guys should talk to someone about it, or you make macaroni, drink wine, and forget about it. Smart decision. Smart decisions. After seeing multiple doctors and having many tests, they're worried that Julia might be suffering from early onset dementia. She's 41. Both decide to keep it a secret for now. Well, that's just terrible. That's sad. If people, people who, oh, whoa. People who suffer from early onset dementia, I feel so bad. What the? Wow. A butterfly. Hi, oh, Mr. Butterfly. This looks awesome. Uh, oh, the book. Give me it. Oh, is that me? So pretty. That's me frolicking like a Victoria's Secrets model. So, okay, yeah, we're gonna have to blur that out. Mayhem is getting older. He's got silver hair down his back and slows down at night. You and Julia walk him to the bar to see your friends, and it feels like nothing has changed. Julia goes back to the university. Okay, okay. Julia's, Julia's affliction gets worse. She can't remember things in class. Her research is, sh is in shambles. She drives her car to the next town over for no particular reason and has to be brought home by the police. She's devastated. She's sent home on permanent medical leave. Oh, oh man. Some days you get the Julia who calls you a dope and your unborn children, little idiots. Other days you get a stranger. She pulls you in bed to make love with you. After five minutes, she goes into a panic believing her dad is at the door. This is watching like a life go You tell her family they're crushed and begin to make trips to and from their homes in Australia to visit her while your friends come by with little things to brighten the day. She gets worse. Man, tough. 1988, you spent your days following Julia around the house to count the seconds between the two weekly visits from Daniel the nurse. She suggests, or he suggests, that Julia could live somewhere else, somewhere with 24 hour care, a home. It sits with you for a couple of months. I would never do that to anybody, so I'm, yeah, whoa, whoa, oh, whoa, okay, this, this, okay, I like this, this looks really good, I like this, what was that noise, okay, I was walking, it was just walking sounds. Balance. Oh, 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 a deer. Is that a deer? Oh, oh, deer. Oh, oh, it ended. It is impossibly hard. The worst is when you get mad at her, like when she tries to cook her own food. You can't do anything without her, and she can't do anything without you. This is sad. When she goes to sleep, you stay up for a few hours, drinking on the deck, watching baseball in the summer, college basketball in the winter, drinking then too. You start going out after you put her to bed. The first time you do it, 
The first time you do it, you worry about her getting up and walking around while you're gone. Put a chair in front of the bedroom door, she'll see. She I wouldn't, what? No, don't put a chair in room, cause like, fire hazards maybe? So just let her sleep like a rock. You go to the same bar at the boring end of Pearl Street. It's nice there. Over time you tell Sh Sheila, the bartender, everything. It's a huge weight off. You're home and in bed by 1 a.m. a couple of nights a week. You look forward to those nights. 1989. One night you're stopped at a DUI checkpoint. You blow it point 10 and are taken to the jail for the night. You consider trying to hide it, but you tell your sister-in-law, Susan. That's, yeah. Julia's parents take the next plane from Australia. They can't leave the state your, they can't believe the state your house is in. Then they tell you Julia is coming to live with them. You don't argue, you say you'll visit soon. A few weeks go by. Summer is coming and you see it, an ad in the paper for a job. You take it. Uh, is this where the game starts? Is this where the game starts? Oh, here we go. It started, I think. Uh, enter the lookout tower. So yeah, fire wash, fire wash, blink. This is amazing. Look at this, look at that moon. I even have legs finally and arms. This is amazing, look at this. I love this. This looks just. This is a beautiful game. I'm not gonna lie. This is a nice game. Oh. Oh. Shut. The, okay. Uh, generator switch. Doink. Oh, there's the lights. Oh. Huh? Oh, the. Give me. Uh, oh. What do I do? Oh. Um, hello? Whoever this is? It's Henry, right? Yeah. I'm Delilah. Yeah, that's what the guy said on the phone. So, what's wrong with you? Excuse me? People take this job to get away from something. So what's wrong? What's wrong with you? That's a great idea. Go ahead. Look, I just hiked for two days, so I don't really follow whatever it is you're doing right now. You take a Sabbath, what's wrong with me? Can I sleep forever? Sure, buddy. Okay, now go ahead. Okay, well, let's see what's wrong with her. You killed, <laughs> you've killed three ex-husbands. Rebelling against mom, nobody back home can stand you. Let's just say, yeah. Okay, um, you're probably just rebelling against a mom who wishes you had given her grandkids, by the sound of your voice, at least 15 years ago. You come out here and it really grinds your gears and you love it. Can I sleep now? Well, she also says I talk amateur men, but in my defense, who wouldn't want a 28-year-old with ambition and energy and some fire in his belly in bed? Me, I'm going now. Okay, now it's my turn. Okay, great, bye. Let's see, I don't know anything about you, but nine times out of ten, folks out here simply got dumped. Fuck that, hit it. Up close? Good night. <laughs> Good night, and welcome to job. Oh, that's where the game begins. This says Firewatch. Okay, day one. Okay. And I am typing. Creepy, she's looking at me at my desk. That's creepy. Why is she looking at me at my desk? That's okay. Uh, hey, sorry, I guess I slept in. You got a relaxing, what, 14 hours of sleep? Yeah, Jesus, I guess it's what. 
six. Six forty-five. Oops. Uh, don't worry about it. Uh, the hike hikes everyone out of control. Pine farm. Now that you're up, let me quickly get you acquainted with the job. There's a thing in the middle of your room with a round map on it. Do you see it? Oh, no. oh okay. Uh, yep. Okay. Yeah, I see it. This is the Osborne Firefinder, invented in 1914 by W. B. Osborne. What is it? Nothing. Um, you, uh, you used it to... What? For real? West facing window. Are you seeing West face... What? West facing... West facing... Fireworks? Oh, uh, down... Okay, compass. Uh, west facing window. Is this is this West. West facing window. I don't see fireworks. Oh! I need you to confirm. Do you see them? Yes. That's not legal, right? Uh, no. You need to get down there right now and stop them. Fire danger is due to the fucking roof. Is that really my job? Your job is whatever I say it is. The closest ranger is like two days away. Go down there and set them straight. Alright, it looks like I'm going down there and setting them straight. Let me grab my pack. Yep. Grab my bag. You can handle that? Like, kick the <laughs> out of them. Uh, can I write them a ticket? I'm not... There. Zoom. This ha Zoom. Find ropes in cash box 306. So I don't know where cash... 308, 307, and 306. It's right there. So I need to head this way if I'm, cor if I'm correct. Okay, so I gotta head this way if I'm correct. Yeah, right, right? Cash box 306. So it's, so I'm just gonna follow this path that I'm on, right? I'm on this path. Oh no, wait, I go the other way on the path. Okay. Okay, lower map. Yoink, let's go, bye bye, watchtower. We got 14 hours of sleep. Uh, let's get moving. Joan, Jonas, Jonasy or Jonasy? Yeah, well, let's just take a jog. I love the way this game looks. This game is phenomenal looking. It just like, like, look at that. Look at the graphics. Ooh, a joint. Does it look? This is nice looking. This, I go, like, oh, block. Am I able to report, report this, report? Oh, 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 there we go. I've got an order to trail here. Yeah, that'll happen. Well, if I come across some tools, I'll add groundskeeping to my ever-increasing list of responsibilities. Amazing. Okay, well, let me make sure I'm going the right way still. Uh, yeah, okay, so it's just... Oh, there it is. Wow, I'm freaking blind. There's Cashbox 306. Uh, oh, there we go. The code is one... One, a two, three, no, one, two, three, four. Don't make fun of me, okay, that I got it wrong. Oh, uh, some old rope. Give me that, because she said I'll need a little bit of rope. So give me some more rope. Uh, ooh. 
eat. Nom nom. Oh. Copy information. Okay, map updated, I guess. Take note. Uh, why do we know? Oh, R Ron. Hey, bam. Okay. Guy couldn't take it, so I locked up all his lookout and put some stuff in the box. Found one of those bars you liked. Hiking into the park. Let's get when I'm back. Dave. Alrighty then. Alrighty then. Oh, did I just... Did I... Okay, I dropped that. Give me it. Uh, examine. Leave. I should have read it like that. I would have been more for you guys. Uh, okay. Well, let's just drop that right there. You know, litter a little bit. Uh. Oh, here we go. I'll we'll talk about the note. Yeah, do people lose their out here? That's a good one. people lose their shit doing this job? There's a note that says a guy just left his post. It happens, yeah. Oh. You're not going to pop your top right Henry. I wasn't planning on it. People do lose their crap out here. Okay. Um. Oh, what, what do I do? Ooh, pick up a pine cone. Ooh, ooh, got, got, got the pine cone. Okay, well, we don't need uh, I feel bad leaving that open. Oh, close. There we go. That's but. Guess I'll keep it. Why not? Oh, I could look at it. Great. Okay. Uh, where am I heading? Um. Uh, where am I heading? I am here. Uh, where did she want me to go? Thunder Canyon. Where? I forgot where she wanted me. Forgot where she want me to go. No. Okay. Uh, deal with whoever's setting off fireworks. Do I just stay on the trail I'm on now? Oh, she said. Oh yeah. Okay. I think she she's a Jonas. Yeah, it's Jonasy Lake. So I just stay s going straight on this trail. Well, that looks good. Okay. Yeah. So just I. This way. Oh, I hear. I can hear the fireworks. Well, crap. That's not good. Looks like I'm here now. A jump, yumperdy. Where's that? Oh, there. Okay, so I'm just gonna go the way the fireworks are. Um. Yeah, I'll just go the way the fireworks are. Oh, rope hook. Gosh, they're gonna set a fire off. And I've been to Colorado. That's illegal. That's extremely illegal. Oh, okay then. Yonk. Shale slide. It's steep. Uh oh oh uh. Rapple. <laughs> Buddy, going down the oh oh that's the hurt that knocked out of you dang give me my walkie talkie give me that to this to whatever her name is yeah hey what the hell's wrong with you my rope snapped coming down the shell slide you didn't break anything did you Oh, I'll be careful, I guess. Wait, is this the right way? Let me make sure. Let me make sure, let me make sure. Yeah, I'm still going towards the lake. Okay. She said the lake, right? I hope it's the lake. I'm going towards the fireworks route this way. Anyway, well, this is the trail, so... Beer can. Oh. Hold the clean up. Uh, report beer cans. A bunch of empty beer cans. They threw all over hell. The idiots down at the lake? Yeah. Not them. I just found where they're hanging out. 
Clean up, clean up, everybody everywhere. Clean up, clean up, gotta clean up our environment. Okay, that's all of them. Let's keep moving. Oh, backpacks. Uh-oh. They left their packs tied up here. Don't fuck with them. The last thing we need is some hikers filing a report on harassment. Okay, yeah, let's just stay back from that. Oh, look, they decided to have a campfire, too. You know, they color-coded the fire danger signs in case people were illiterate. But I guess that doesn't take into account just plain stupid, does it? Okay, that should take care of the fire. Ooh, some whiskey. Ooh, am I able to drink this? Oh. Mm. Oh, I can hold it for later. Yes, I do. Give me it. I just wanted to examine it. Arator. Single malt whiskey. Yeah, save it for later. <laughs> yeah. Alrighty. Uh, oh, of course, the beer cans. Clean up. Oh, what's this? Uh, examine. A magic missile screaming wife. I will confiscate, just in case they set off any more uh okay let's move this is the trail right yep all right ebon oh yeah uh yeah that's not good i found a bra yeah okay okay i guess i will i should put it on <laughs> Okay, anyway. Oh no, I'm not even gonna touch that. Uh, there are, uh, panties. There are what? I don't want to say that word again. Why, because you're 12? I'm not touching that. Uh oh. I hear music. My ear hears music. Oh jeez. Oh no. Wow, that's funny. <laughs> the way she said that. Oh, crap. Oh, yeah. Okay. Well, there are people. No cloths on. Okay. Um. Oh, yeah. I know your lighting fireworks, quit the fireworks, or else, please cool down the fireworks. Yeah. Don't want any more shit from your fucks, right? Don't threaten us. Who the hell are you, creep? He's just one of the loners out here. Yeah, he's just one of the loner guys who likes to boss people around. Huh. I just think it's alright to just stare at girls. Yeah, fuck off. Oh, they are drunk. Oh, I didn't even see that. Okay. Well, they are drunk. Oh, and they disappeared behind that rock. Beam this boombox freaking sucks. Yeah, freaking song sucks. Oh. Yeah, I hope they drown. They drown. <laughs> and I don't think anyone would mourn a couple of future arsonists. Just gonna go ahead and 
Underwear's still strewn all over down here. Well, it is a particularly wormy thing. Let's try one on. Okay. Uh, I gotta find a way back now, I guess. Uh, let me look at my map here. Um, the smart decision would probably be to just head straight back the way I came, right? Yeah, be the smart decision. Head straight back where I came. Oh, how do I get back? Yeah, there we go. Back to that big rock outcropping, but not sure how to get back. Head west, back towards the lake, and then turn north towards the canyon. What? Head west. So west, so head west towards the lake and then turn north towards the canyon. Okay. Oh, okay, so head west towards the lake, I guess. Um, let's take a jog. Junky, 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 Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Is this a trail? Nope. Where's the trail? Oh, head west. She said head west. Toward, no. Oh. She said head west towards the lake and turn north towards the canyon. Is this north towards the canyon? Oh, here we go. All right. I'm out here all by myself, only got this walkie talkie. Just out here. I, fr I just love this so much. This, this is like my type of setting. I love like nature and hiking. So this is my type of game right here. Just nature. I love nature so much. Look at this beautiful game. And Colorado, it looks very much like this. I've never been in, like, rural, rural, rural how do you say it? I, okay. I've never been in just, North, like, Colorado with just the nature of it. I've been in populated areas of Colorado and, like, Garden of the Gods and stuff. But, like, nothing like this. And I would really love to do something like this. It'd be really cool. And I'd make videos while doing it, of course. Wow. You bet this place. So, oh. I have a bit of a confession to make. And what was it? What is it? Um, I was, I was drunk last night when I woke up to get a job. Yeah, well, you're, you're not, not the first boss, boss to be guilty of that. that. Oh. I know, I just, I know I can get a little pushy, you know, putting on the spot about uh, why you're out here and stuff. And you, you thought, thought it was a good idea to get into your um, love life, life, I guess you'd call it? Yeah, it's not a big deal. I'll, I'll, I'll keep that sort of thing to, uh, to a minimum. Anyway, let me know when you get back to your lookout. Okay, I guess so. I'll just let her know, I guess. It's a way walkie. It's getting a little dark. Yeah, this thing probably fills with water if it rains. Which, it would, yeah. Oh. Hey, I heard some thunder. Yeah, I've got eyes on the storm out to the north. Well, that's bad, right? Because of the lightning? It just seems we'll be busy. Hurry home and try not to get hit by lightning. What? I got hit by lightning when I was nine years old, so I'm safe. It's not going to strike twice and all that. Well, there was an old scout named Roy Sullivan who got hit by lightning seven times. I don't like the sound of that. Yeah. Well, if it makes you feel any better, it wasn't what killed him. What killed him? Suicide. Would you believe? That's terrible. Oh, is that a cave? Can I go in the cave? I want to go in the cave. Oh. What's in this cave? 
Thunder Canyon. Oh, Thunder Canyon. Hey, I didn't name it. But in the cave, I don't know, rocks? NFS tells people not to go too far in there. It's pretty dangerous. So... So, I say, fuck it. You're a grown man, you can go where you want. Great. I used to go caving with someone back in Colorado. She loved it. Might be great to explore it sometime this summer. But that could be fun. Obviously, be very careful. What am I not in Colorado? Open this here. Wonder if there's any more snacks in it. If there's any more snacks in it. Oh, gotta copy the information. Yep. Always a good idea to copy the information. All right, copy. Uh. Oh, is that a light? Yes. Ah. Oh, bright. Okay. Uh, now I have a light. I wonder how I use it. Um, okay. Can I get the sense that not everything in here is useful? In the boxes? What's that? I don't really know what I'll do with the deer horn. Firstly, they're called antlers. And secondly, stay out here long enough and you'll get creative. How do I turn on my light? How do I turn on my light? How do I turn on my light? I gotta figure out how to turn on my light. Oh, there we go. That's how I turn it on. Now I've got a light. Great. Oh, report lock this gate. This cave is gated off. It's to stop smokers from dying without getting the keys from the Forest Service office first. Makes sense. I guess I climb out of this cave. And zoop. Oh, it is, it is dark out here. I'm gonna look at you guys because my computer monitor is a lot brighter. It's very dark and creepy up on my TV. She's being sarcastic. I didn't get that. I'm slow. Oh, what a I'm slow. Slow brain. Slow brain. Which way do I go? I'll go this way. Oh, no. Hold on. Let me check my map. Am I still heading towards my tower? Wind's blowing this thing around a little bit. Where's my tower? Oh, here we go. Okay, well, uh, then I take this one right here. Where is it? Yeah, it's this path right here. I take this path. Very thundery, lightningy out here. Very thundery, lightningy. Uh oh, more climbing. Uh oh, time to climb. I'm to be Spider Man. Spider Man. Also, I have climbed uh, stuff like this before in Guard of the Gods in Colorado, but like, it'd be fun. It'd be fun to just do something like this. You know, go out with your friends and do something like this. Ooh, there we go. All the way up. Whew. 
iron. And I fell. What? Now I'm recording a video. No, I'm recording a video. Because I'm recording a video. I'll see you in a little bit. It's always there. Okay, well. I broke it. Uh, well, that trail isn't closed anymore. Oh, really? Yeah. I took a turn of the block path. Um, it was backbreaking, but you know, anything for the service. Well, thank you. Anytime. Oh, my humble abode. What is this? The generator. What? What am I gonna say to her? This is all the electricity I've got. Okay. So this generator is all the power I've got out here. Yep. It doesn't chew much gas, and um, you don't have much in the way of electronics, so. What about my hair dryer? Oh, I'm sorry. You might just have to do kids with friendly locks. I could never. Ooh. Outhouse? his name? Then Bill? What's his name? Boris Burns. I like this. I'm gonna keep him. You're coming with me, guy. You're coming with me, my friend. Very, very nice. Very nice. Oh! Oh, no. Uh, uh, drop. What? Uh, uh, Right? Yeah. Well, uh, the wind? No. How the hell? You should get inside. Yeah, I should. I should. I should get inside. I should get inside. I should get inside. Yeah, yeah. Inside. 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 What was that? That I could examine. Oh, uh, uh. Okay. Oh my. Okay. Yeah, that's not good. Hey, what? It's just came right to the place. Threw my typewriter out the window. Motherfucker. Holy shit. Um. Oh, no, not to my beautiful typewriter. Put that thing back. There, hit the switch. Close the door. Okay, never mind. Don't close the door. The place is trashed. Okay, I put in a call. What can they do about it? Will they catch whoever did it? This is the Forest Service, Henry. They're not exactly a Hawaii 5 -0. Do you have any idea who would have done this? They did probably piss off the girls at the lake. Oh, definitely. I didn't probably. Oh. Well, I'll have the rangers keep an eye out for a couple of young women and question any they find. I can't believe someone would do this. I worry about bears and fires. And I Service weapons cache will feel safer than the Pope in his old car. Yeah, uh, someone made the choice years ago that leaving people with infinite amounts of alone time and a gun was kind of a bad idea. Grenades? I'll see what I can do. Yes! Grenades! Oh, day two. Um. Okay then. Well, guys, I'm gonna leave it there at day two. I'm gonna leave it there at day two. That is all I'm going to play for today. 
I have got a video to I've got a video to film tomorrow, so I'm gonna just leave it there in day two. Uh that's this is a good game so far. I really like this. Hopefully the story gets crazier, because I like crazy and spooky wook. So this is gonna be the end, right? Oh wait, we'll get this first part in. Alright. Okay. Guys, so this is the end. This is this is the yeah. This is the end. Or you know, never mind. Hold on. Let's do this. Give me the radio. Now I can. Okay, this is gonna. Uh, okay, guys. So this is the end of the video. I've got a video to film tomorrow, so I gotta edit this and upload this tonight. Uh, this is a very fun game, and I hope to do more of this game. Uh. But yeah, I'm going to do a part two of this game 100%. This is a good game. Uh, but yeah, see you guys next time and goodbye.